Well, howdy there, folks. My name is Senator Wayne Wilson White, and I approve this message. Good evening. You are watching fake news on Channel 7 with Denver's sleaziest anchorman, Dan. I'd rather not. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Fake News. I am your host, Dan. I'd rather not. And I'm here today with newly appointed candidate for the Democratic Party, Senator Connie Asada. Con picante salsa de la Rio Grande de la Cruz McCain. Senator, uh, first question, let's get right into it. I hear that you are married. How long have you been married for? Oh, I've been married 10 wonderful years to the same honey I still love. I have no eyes for no other woman in the never, world. Never looked at another woman? Never ever looked at another woman. Oh! Wow. Wow. Never pushed up on another woman, no. Ten never partied in Vegas with another no. woman? No. No. Okay. No. Um, second question is, what are your thoughts on immigration? Well, I, for one, am not with the immigration reform laws that Trump has been trying to put into place. It's no good. They've affected my primos, my primas, Lulu, Lalo, Lili, Chula, Cholo, Paco, and Pika. Does this look like a man who cares about the well-being of little Lulu and little Cholo? I don't think so. Senator Asada has been spotted numerous times with President Trump at the border with plans of putting up a wall. Yes or no is good, no bueno. What are your thoughts on Donald Trump and his administration? No Donald Trump, down with Donald Trump. He builds too many walls, he tries to affect all my cousins, my grandma, my tios, tias, no. Senator Asada McCain has been spotted numerous times with President Donald Trump. They were both going in on a Tuesday. Okay, okay, sounds good. So the next question is, what sets you apart from the other candidates? Not only um, in the Democratic race, but in the Republican race as well. Well, Mr. Rather not. Boss, listen to my name, Mr. Rado Not. I mean, you have one name, Rado Not. Listen to my name, Senator Carne Asada, con picante salsa de Rio Grande de la Cruz, McCain. You tell me what other candidate has a name like that? No, not one that I have met. That's for sure, no, Mr. No. De la Cruz no, McCain. No, no. What Senator Asada McCain doesn't really want you to know is his real birth name is Osama bin Bamin and he has been linked to such extreme organizations like ISIS, the KKK, and worst of all, the Takashi 69 fan club. Next question is, what is, and this is a very very important question, it's been on the minds of a lot of a lot of voters. So we're going to get right into it. I'm going to ask you, and I want you to answer as truthfully as you can. What is your stance on the legalization, the federal legalization of marijuana? Oh, no, 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 mota, no mota for Senator Carne Asada de la Cruz de Picante Salsa de Rio Grande de McCain. No mota. What you're saying is you, you have a strong stance against marijuana. You don't like it. No. No oh, mota, absolutely no mota for Senator Carmen Asada con picante salsa de Rio Grande de la Cruz McCain. So can you can you tell us what with this? Let's just cut to the clip. Pump, pump, pass, nigga, why you hog? I'm blowing smoke in the air, go to green pollution. Now the tennis so blown, think they seen illusion. Got, got friends, baby, well, I'll introduce them. All they with it on, not maybe lose them. About to turn up, let loose, get into it. Yeah, had a sound for a good. Can you explain that for us? Oh, uh, I do not recall, but I know I did not inhale. Okay. Can you please tell the people out there why they should vote for you as the next American president? As I said before, I have a very luxurious name. Senator Carne Asada con picante salsa del Rio Grande de la Cruz McCain. Also, I, I, it shows here that you are going on, what is it now, one year of sobriety? Congratulations. Yes. How's that working? I have given a drinking. It's been one whole year, not that I drank a whole bunch before that. A little glass of wine here, 
maybe a Corona, Marello, you know. At the family barbecues, at the pachangas, but I gave it up. No more. No okay. more drinking. Very, very interesting. One year. One question, Mr. McCain. Three. How did you get McCain? I understand the the De La Grande and La Cruz and hot salsa and steak tacos, but where does McCain come from? Where did that come from? It's because my mother and my father, they divorced a few times and my mom got married and married and finally she married a white man in the end. So I know McCain. Sounds good. That's the winner's name. There you have it. Senator McCain, come here, salsa, salsa, picante, Taco Bell. It's been very nice having you on the show tonight and uh, good luck with running for president. Thank you, Mr. Aranat. You guys have a great night. You've heard it here first, folks, on fake news. I am Dan. I'd rather not. Reporting live. You've heard it here first. We'll see you next week. Make sure you vote for Mr. McCain for president in 2020. We'll see you next week. And what is your name, sir? My name's uh, Mr. Will. Mr. Will. And what are your thoughts on Senator Asada? Uh, Senator Asada, that guy, is, uh, he's good to go. He's a family man. Uh, him and I share the same beliefs. Um, I definitely enjoy what he, uh, what he stands for, and he definitely gets my vote. Now, the question you must ask yourself, is Senator Asada McCain the right candidate for you? Would you trust this man with your children? And the last thing I will say is, he is racist. He hates all Mexicans. This message is approved for by the Republican National House of Democratic Association. Vote for Carmen Asada in 2020.